you have to be uh, a little wily. I mean, I think uh, the difference between um, uh, being a, an ac a modern academic starting up and being a used car salesman is uh, quite small, actually. <laughs> you have to be really quite uh, um, innovative. OK, the deal of the century. Well, if we compare with here, this wonderful, nice new piece of equipment, which costed over £100,000 uh, and came with full service contracts and everything, with, um, well, let's start with this. Um, this we bought um, off eBay for about £2,000, and it cost us another couple of thousand pounds to get it upgraded properly, and it's new, it would be about eight or nine thousand pounds, so uh, we've uh, got ourselves a very good deal there. You look happy with yourself. <laughs> I'm very happy with myself. Uh, it's just an utterly bog-standard piece of equipment, uh, to the more technically minding, a scanning UV spectrometer, uh, but, uh, and desperately we needed one anyway, um, but we didn't have eight thousand pounds. But it came with a nice deal. It came with uh, a couple of these, which are for protein purification. And better than that, uh, <laughs> they'd also packed in free for us, because they needed to get rid of them, um, loads and loads of spare parts. And the thing about these is, because they're specialists, they're also quite expensive. So this is uh, this type of column body here, new, is about three or four hundred pounds and we've got about seven or eight of them. So uh, the £4,000 it cost us um, on eBay to get these and then ship it across the from the States on a ship and then pay the customs duty was well, well worth it just for the spare parts. The fact we've also got working equipment as well is brilliant. So um, this sort of is really making, <laughs> stretching the... Uh, it, stretching the budget a bit but uh, we're actually in the end actually getting more bang for our buck out of uh, what was what we're getting um, I had to bid and uh, although I got all these immediately um, this one went up from 600 pounds which would be an absolute peach of a deal to just over 2,000 um, which was uh, a real pain to say the least because uh, I you know Getting this for 600 quid would be fantastic, but you know, um, we've still got it for essentially a nice new one for half price. It's a really, really simple device. Um, into here, you put your sample in a quartz cell, okay. Uh, light comes in through here, okay, and is registered over here. And at certain wavelengths along here, it will absorb. Okay, so proteins absorb about 280 nanometers in a peak, um, and from that you can work out their concentration. So it's nothing stunning, right? But it means that we can very accurately work out our concentrations. Well, I think it's going to be a one-off uh, at the moment. Uh, I, I mean, it was it was such a hassle getting it into the country. Um, um, you have to deal with Her Majesty's customs. You have to have a port of arrival and all these sort of things. Um, as far as I know, I'm the only one I know who's actually done this. I was chatting to a colleague of mine at Warwick and he giggled horrendously and has told everybody. So every time the reps for these new pieces of equipment come round, they go, yeah, we've heard of you. Yeah, you're the guy, the guy that bought them off eBay, aren't you? <laughs> I saved an absolute fortune, and what's, what's more, we've got loads and loads of work done in the meantime on the six months since we bought it, which, um, as we still haven't been funded for a new one yet, uh, we wouldn't have been able to do. So you have to be uh, a little wily. I mean, I think uh, the difference between um, uh, being a, an ac a modern academic starting up and being a used car salesman is uh, quite small, actually. <laughs>